All right, this is Eric Kudla here. Um, we're here at Laughlin. This is round eight of the Kenda SRT West Hair Scramble Championship, the finale. Um, we have Kevin from Dark Side MC and Bob from XMC. They actually got together to put together this event and be co-sanctioned with both Moran and Amra. So it's gonna be a big event. We've already got 210 pre-entries. Um, so this is our first time to Laughlin. This is our first time working with the two clubs. Um, what do we, what do we, what is there to look forward to this weekend? Got a great course lined out for you. The uh, the A B course is going to take you uh, an extra 13 miles beyond the 14 loop for the C course. Uh, going to throw everything at you. Got nice downhills. Got some rock. Got some nice uphills. Some nice clean, fast lines. Uh, really fast sections to go through. Just. Uh, be on your toes. Be careful for the choyas that are going to jump out. The rain has done wonders um, to the vegetation out here. So I think it's going to be a great course. It's a fun course to ride. Heck yeah. All right, so and, and he told us a little bit about, about the AB course. Can you tell us about like the minis and the youth? Yeah, we have a great that? course for the, uh, for the, 50, uh, the 50 riders. Um, people spend almost the entire day today uh, creating the 50 course. It's uh, about two miles long. Um, they've actually had to hand uh, hand groove and and uh, you know hand hand make some areas to take out some of the gnarlier uh, little washouts. But a lot of time has been spent for the 50 course. Uh, the uh, 65, 85 course uh, is eight miles long. Um, it's very much uh, uh, you know same thing as what some of the sea riders go through. Um, so the 85 guys are going to have to be on their toes. Guys and girls be on their toes. Uh, same thing. Lots of choya. Uh, rain ruts, but just a really, really fun course, and I think the uh, the kids on the minis are gonna love it. Heck yeah! So I actually got the opportunity to ride both the A B course and the C course, and there was definitely a lot of choya. Yeah. So for the people that don't know what that is, can you give us let us know what that is and what you should do to either avoid it or get it out of your hands when you do run yeah. into it? Choya is almost inevitable. Even if you try to avoid it, you can brush by one and they, they're known as jumping cactus. And so uh, they have barbs that will actually go in your skin and when they go in your skin, they're, when you try to pull them out, it actually makes them embed farther in your skin. So in the event you get a Choya ball on you, the best thing is to take like a pick comb and try to flick it out. You can't touch a choy with your hands because then it'll just ball up in your hands. Um, if you've got a buddy there or somebody with you, they can take a couple sticks. If you don't have a comb, they can take a couple sticks and flick the choy off you. Um, if you've got a choy on your bike, you want to make sure and do the same thing. Take sticks or something and get it off your bike because if it's on your bike, it's eventually going to be in you. And uh, generally, uh, it's going to be in you for a while. So. Yeah, absolutely. I actually had to help, <laughs> I had to help Jim take it off out of his glove earlier today. Yeah. So. Um, so yeah, we've got a lot of good stuff um, coming up for this weekend. The, the weather's been great. We've got a lot of moisture in the ground. So uh, get very excited for the finale of the season and look forward to seeing everybody here. We'd like to thank uh, Moto City as the uh, AMRA series sponsor and the Fly Racing is the mini series sponsor. They just came on board this year. They've been a phenomenal uh, partner and Moto City's been with us for a number of years. And so we have really good partners at uh, AMRA. All right, so we'll see you guys here.